Welcome to Bible Top 10, all you Bible nerds. Today we're talking about the shortest verses in the Bible. Before we start, I gotta say, chapter and verses weren't inspired by God, so this is ultimately trivia. I used the King James Version to compile this list, and verses that contain only names like 1 Chronicles 1-1 are excluded because with those included, it really wouldn't be a very interesting list. Uh, one more thing, if you'd like to know how I gathered this data, check out this instructional video. Without further ado, here's number 10. Hebrews 13.1, Let Brotherly Love Continue. This is an exhortation to Christians at the end of the book of Hebrews, basically encouraging the early Christians to let their light shine. Number 9, 1 Thessalonians 5.25, Brethren, pray for us. This is the first of five verses on this list from 1 Thessalonians 5. Paul gives a lot of advice to close out 1 Thessalonians, and he requests prayer in this verse. Number 8, 1 Thessalonians 5.19, Quench not the Spirit. In other words, do not put out the fire of the Holy Spirit with selfish and rebellious living. Number seven, Exodus 20:15, Thou shalt not steal. This is a verse from the Ten Commandments, which seems to establish private property rights. Number six, Exodus 20:13, Thou shalt not kill. Another verse from the Ten Commandments, which would be better understood as Thou shalt not murder. Number 5, 1 Thessalonians 5.20, Despise not prophesyings. Apparently there were those abusing the gift of prophecy in the Thessalonian church. In spite of that, we should be open to the possibility of receiving a word from God. Number 4, 1 Thessalonians 5.17, Pray without ceasing. A very short verse that demands a whole lot, though it really just means communicate with God in all circumstances. Number 3, Luke 17.32, Remember Lot's wife. This comes in a passage regarding the coming of the Son of Man, which is compared to the destruction of Sodom and Gomorrah when Lot's wife, being too attached to her earthly life, looked back as they fled and was turned into a pillar of salt. Number 2, 1 Thessalonians 5.16, Rejoice evermore, or Rejoice always, which is another short verse that packs quite a punch. Our joy doesn't depend on earthly circumstances, so even when tragedy comes, we can rejoice. In number one, John 11.35, Jesus wept. This is a fascinating verse, not only for being the shortest in the entire Bible, but also because of its context. Jesus' friend Lazarus had died four days earlier, and even though Jesus knew he was about to raise him from the dead, he wept. He entered into our sufferings and wept, and not too long after, he died on the cross, so that he could conquer sin and death and wipe away all our tears for good. Well, that completes the list. Don't forget to check out how I compiled this list in this video. And Bible nerds, I'll see you later.